Let's talk saw blades. Hello, I'm Robert Daly and this is the Daily Woodworks YouTube channel. Today I'm going to talk about my favorite saw blades for my table saw, miter saw, circular saw, reciprocating saw, and anything that has a spinning blade on it. And that is the Freud Diablo saw blades. I use these blades on my circular saw, my reciprocating saw, my table saw, and my miter saw. And I have tried all the different brands of blades and there are plenty of decent brands out there. Um, pretty much if you go with the name brand you're alright, but these Diablo blades have become my go-to favorites and I run them on all of my saws that I can find the blades for. Now I dug through my circular saw bin to see what blades I have. You can tell what that one is. You can tell what that one is. And you can tell what that one is. These are ones I've got picked up whenever I didn't have a choice to buy anything different. And this one, I have very little complaints about. This is a very good blade. However, as you see, my circular saw is currently running Diablo 40 tooth 7 and a quarter inch blade. On my circular saws, most of what I do with the circular saw is ripping sheets of plywood. So I keep a higher tooth count, um, 40 tooth fine finish blade on there. Cut through a two by four just fine, but most of the time I'm cutting through on the miter saw. Now I'm not the type who changes blades on their saws for each job I do. I've decided that for me, the best thing to do is pick kind of the best all around blade and leave it on my saw until it needs replaced. So this 62 Diablo, 60 tooth Diablo blade, has built a deck, two decks, cut a bunch of crown, built some cabinetry, and what else has this one done? So pressure treated, uh, regular pine, oak, poplar, plywoods. This, uh, this blade has cut the works, and it has lasted a plenty long time. I can't tell you how long it's lasted exactly, um, I wish there was like a cut counter on these blades or something so you could see how many cuts you got out of them. But what spurred me to make this video is it's time to be replaced. Now they make an 80 tooth super fine finish um, for a 10 inch circular saw for your 12 inches. They have even higher tooth counts. But I found the 60 tooth count is just right for everything I do. Provides a super clean cross cut, um, very smooth. So this guy right here, 10 inch Diablo 60 tooth fine finish. For my table saw, I like these Diablo general purpose 40 tooth blades. They make a 50 tooth blade that's also really good, but for the price difference between the 50 tooth and the 40 tooth, um, I can't tell enough difference in, pro in the performance to justify the cost. And that's what I use for everything I do on a table saw until it wears out. So that's it. These are the blades that I use um, on all of my tools and very much my preferred blade. They make more expensive blades out there and arguably better blades. Um, for what I do, I can't justify the extra cost of having a blade and for the price of sharpening those more expensive blades, I can just go pick one of these up um, and throw the old one in the trash because I abuse my blades. I, if there's a nail on a board, um, as long as you know it's you know, if there's a nail on a board, I really don't worry about it. I'm gonna rip right through it. And so if I tear up a blade, it goes in the trash. And those higher end blades are great if you have a very controlled shop and you control what goes through it. Can't always do that on a job site. Be sure to check the links below for affiliate links. That helps me buy my kids shoes and food and all that kind of good stuff and buy me more tools whenever they have all those other things, which never happens. They're always outgrowing shoes. And I hope that answers the question for you. Um, again, that's my preferred blade. Not saying that any other blade is bad, but from what I've seen, these are about the best you can get for the money. All right, see you next time. Thanks for watching Daily Woodworks YouTube channel. Please give this video a like and subscribe. Bye.